Now we're starting our walk back from Wynn's Hotel. And I just want to show you a walk from the hotel to fields. And we're off. It's kind of breezy. We've been dealing with some thunderstorms today. Hello out there. That big white building all over there is... Oh! Actually, that's Central Park. I thought I was going to say it's Penthouse, but Central Park is very colorful. Penthouse is very... very bland. That, that big white building next to the one with the yellow, what, what appears to be next to the one with the yellow, that is Penthouse, that big white building. And the one with the yellow is Central Park. Here we are crossing the street. No lights. We cross on the trust system here. We trust that people aren't gonna wanna run us over. But even then, I need to get out the way. Here we go. Here we go. There's a little shops here. I'm just gonna walk straight to fields, pretty much. I'm gonna try not to stop and get sidetracked. So, here we go. Let's walk. What long, Paul? What long? Building on the on the right hand side is Wild Wild Orchard Resort. See, it's only been two. It's pretty much a two to three minute walk to Wild Orchard. So it's not that it's not that far at all. Bars used to be 24 hours. Things have really died down. It's not as busy as it used to be. It's Wild, or Wild Orchard Resort. Apartments, condos for rent. I believe they're around two thousand, three thousand per night. And this is this is Penthouse Hotel right here. As I mentioned in, in the previous video, these are uh, that's that's one of the entrances. There's two entrances to Penthouse. Sorry, Julia. Rob's Gastro Pub for those who want to watch sports, sporting events. It's a lot of sports bars. Well, not a lot, but I mean, you'll, you'll, if you need to watch something, you will find a place to watch it. There's no shortage of places to watch to watch your sports. If you don't, if you're the type to want that wants to be outside, having having drinks, having a meal. While you're while you're watching your sporting events, and all sporting events take most of, most American sporting events take place in the morning here, because that is the evening time over at um, in the U.S. The only exceptions are when you have like games at noon, 
or 1 p.m. Do the afternoon games. Those games will take place at either midnight, 1 a.m., 2 a.m. Because it's pretty much a 12-hour difference from most places. Now, just trying to get through here. And this is this is Walking Street, and I pretty much made it in five and a half minutes. Here is Coke. Kokomo's here on the side. Kokomo's here on the side. Everybody's trying to sell me something. That's why I kind I kind of don't like coming out here. And that is that's pretty much the end of the video. I'm gonna walk home now because it's raining. Hope you enjoyed. Hope this helps you. Adios.